Hello, welcome to West Anime Sims. My name is Kelvin and how are you doing? We are back with another video. This time around, we're going to react to The Sims 2 trailers throughout all the years. I'm going to look at Sims 2 trailers throughout the years. So let's check out all the fun, exciting trailers that have been released to promote The Sims 2 expansion packs and the stuff packs. So we start off with uh, some of the trailers way before The Sims 2 is released back in 2003 and we go to the expansion packs then lastly on the second video I think we'll be focusing more on the stuff packs so yeah I'm pretty excited because The Sims 2 is my favorite game and it's definitely the trailers are getting me more excited and hyped to get it back in the day so let's Rewind and look back to The Sims 2 trailers, starting with Official Trailer by Electronic Arts. EA Games. EA Games. Challenge everything. Huh? Oh, God. <laughs> uh, transformation of Sims 1 to Sims 2. Back then, it was so revolutionary. It was so good. <laughs> I mean, some of the items look like they're familiar with the Sims 1, but they make it 3D, and it's funny. Okay, the third time's a charm. Uh... Oh! We will only get to see that in our TVs, definitely. She just lets it all loose, and we have babies now. Back then, it was the most Exciting things happening. God, the fire. Ah, oh, I wish kids can just hang on a fan like that. That's bizarre. Now they are teenagers now. Oh my god. Now they are out of the house. They graduated. <laughs> Time for something. They are getting married. Uh, they have grandkids now. Uh, the next generation. Okay, that was the Sims 2 official trailer. Really bizarre things happened. And unfortunately, not all of them went into the actual final game, but that was really excited. It got me really pumped up, really excited about having kids and kids and kids. Uh, generations, people seems growing up to become old and have kids on their own. That was the main selling point of The Sims 2 back in the day. So there is another trailer that I don't really see often, but I actually see it uh, after Sims 2 was almost the end, but I'm really ex interested to curious to look for this version. Oh. Sims 1. Okay, the graphics looks closer to the Sims 2 final version. And the logo as well is pretty much more of a final version of the Sims 2. Family. Okay, this one is showing off aspirations. <laughs> okay, this is... Wow! Mom goes to fame. Really nice transitions. This is like a reference for me when I did some animation last time. Too bad this doesn't ha happen in the final game.
okay, that commercial actually talked more about aspirations. That's another selling point for The Sims 2. I think it came out after the postpone of six months from early 2004 to September 2004. That's another good uh, aspect of gameplay that actually has been persisted throughout the years, but didn't really work out the, the best. I would say the Sims 2 aspiration model is the best. There's another Sims 2 trailer, I think it's from E3. I do notice there's a pattern of them starting out in The Sims 1 and then it morphs The Sims 2, biggest sequel to the biggest PC game of all time. Make your Sims more out of life. Okay, mixing cheese. Expanding the family trees, that's what we know so far. Romance. Orchard. Yes, the helicopter. Seems for whatever. Popularity. Knowledge. Oh my god. <laughs> Take them to the extreme. Oh. Fire. Fighting. Ghosts. Getting arrested. Oh my gosh. And alien abduction, definitely. And unleash your creativity. Create. Okay, it seems to create a sim is way more advanced than the sims 1. So this is like. Like a few day for us having can adopt. Change hairstyles, change her eyes, change her lips, and makeup, and everything. Create landscapes. Oh, you can create your own neighborhood in The Sims 2. Build the largest uh, mansion in The Sims 2. One Pleasant View, I think. There's another build from Pleasant View as well. I do like this house as well. Change swatches. That was the first time we can actually change the colors of the furniture. Yeah. Next, we we'll go move on to expansion packs now. So first expansion pack we're going to look into is the Sims 2 University. So this is the expansion pack that really changes everything. Oh. Love the song. The Sims are taking over campus. Hanging out. <laughs> My god, people going out naked. I thought that was an American thing. <laughs> Experience the college lifestyle. Having pillow fights for your roommates. Having toga parties. Earn a degree to unlock new careers. That is really nice. Graduation, that didn't really happen in the Sims 2 University. New college town, and 100 new items, which is the pool table, arcade machine. In this chaos to buy electronics, bonfire. And this plastic surgery machine. A lips couch. Become the big sim on campus. Instruments, yes, being a rock man in the Sims 2 University itself. Coming out in March 2005. Uh, next expansion pack is the Sims 2 Nightlife. It's one of my favorite expansion packs to date. A remix of the Sims 2. Sims are an epic night out. New downtown neighborhood, a club, and lounges, bowling alleys. Oh my gosh, the Sims 4 actually made a game pack out of it, stuff pack out of it. Whereas we can all have it in the same expansion pack. Karaoke, machine, dancing, dog, 
our restaurant system, that was really nice. We have played a mini dating game. A proposal on the table, throwing drinks if you don't like their date. And steamy action going on, especially in the car. The Sims have cars. Sims 4, where is our cars? Where are our cars? Live it up with 125 new items. We have poker table. Some nightlife decor, photo booth. This weird dance sphere I like in put in clubs. Bring on the night in fall 2005. Okay, that was the best expansion pack I we have. Still is, and the music in The Sims 2 Nightlife really slaps until this day. I think almost 20 years. This is really good stuff. So the next expansion pack we're going to look into is The Sims 2 Open for Business. Now this expansion pack really revolutionized the gameplay. You can actually sell anything in The Sims 2 Open for Business. It, it be it from the future past expansion packs and even in the future expansion packs so it's really changed how sims work and owning business is a really nice touch let's see what we have here sims getting down to business Open. power shops tea salon Create new and unique businesses like electronic stores, have robots, salon, bakeries, and more. The lemonade stand to be the boss, even though as you are a kid, you can train employees and promote your best ones and fire the rest. Learn the tricks of the trade, like selling prices, like improve your sales skills, like getting customers in the street, making the quick bucks. Turn talents into cash, like making your own toys or customer items, like the servo. Remember servo? Right in the Sims 1. Over 125 new items. <laughs> if you have things for kids and the elevator as well, so what business will you create in Sims 2? Coming in spring 2006. Wow. Always have the nice nostalgic feel in the Sims 2 trailers. So next is the Sims 2 pets. So Another round of pets. Great dogs and cats for the Sims. You can customize a lot of things in the Sims. Create a pet feature. So you can train your pet. Oh shit. Oh goodness, that was a nightmare for you have your own cats and dogs. You're using your furniture. You can play with them. They fetch them. It's really nice. Dog. Oh, nice. By the way, that's for open for business and sprinkler. Cute. Share a lifetime together. Even read. Oh, nice stuff. And all new items for pets. Big cool. Nice stuff. And the Sims 2 pets actually came into Nintendo and PlayStation. So it diff provides a different gameplay. Train your pets in the town park.
and also in Nintendo DS, so Sims can run a pet center in this version. Get your paws on it for The Sims 2 Pets. Oh, that's a really cute trailer. I really love it so much. Even though Pets is not my main gameplay for The Sims in any version. But it's nice to have pets in your game. The next is The Sims 2 Seasons. This is the first time we introduce weather and seasons in a game. So let's check out how they promote the game. So enjoy all four seasons with your sims. To so delight in the winter wonderland. So you strengthen family ties. Uh, build a snowman with you to control snowballs, fights, making snow angels. Oh, the ice skating ring. Oops. So you have to bundle up to keep warm. With nice winter wear and enjoy spring shelter showers. That romance view. Fishing. Nice. Sizzling up in summer. Now, there are different perks in every season. So, families for winter, romance for summer, uh, romance for spring, friendship is for summer. And revel in four colors. Oh, this is really pretty for back in the day. Harvest fruits and vegetables. And you make juice out of it. Home country vibes to it. And all new items like the slide. We don't have slides in Sims 4. Scarecrow. Oh, this country kitchen. I use it a lot of times for some home decorations. So yeah, the Sims 2 seasons have a really nice cozy feel. I think cozy is still is a really uh captivating mood or vibe that Sims 2 managed to capture throughout the whole uh, run of their era. The next is the Sims 2 Bon Voyage. Let's check it out. <laughs> Bored with the home routine. So break away from the everyday and take go to vacation. Discover exotic track destinations with your sims. Like a mountain getaway. Let's go camping. This is really similar to the Sims 1 vacation. There are three different climates. Or you can still stay in the country lounge and have saunas. And some axe throwing. I do wish we should have archery instead. We have the log roll thing as well. We discover the Far East. Not so sure it's Korea, China, or Japan, they just mix it up together, stay in the Far East. Some local food suitcase. Do some Tai Chi, relax in tropical paradise. Luxury hotel, you can have massages, have fire dance, it's really nice. And you can shop for jewelry. So become a savvy international traveler. <laughs> and discover exotic travel destinations with the Sims coming in September 2007. Okay, that was a different take on the Sims 1 vac vacation comparatively, but it's, there are some similarities to it. I do really like the idea of taking Sims to vacation. That's really a really nice take. Not my favorite expansion pack, but I do use a lot of the items in Sims 2 Bon Voyage, especially the Asian 
uh, Far East cultures, uh, the items. I use it way a lot in my builds. So next is my favorite trailer of mine, but not necessarily the most favorite expansion pack, I think. This, so it's the Sims 2 free time official trailer. Escape from the things you have to do, like work, cleaning, homework, and do the things you want to do. Oh, this trailer is getting more and more cinematic, I would say. We have sports, basketball, football. We can do some arts and crafts, sewing machine. Ballet bar. You can do some bird watching with science and nature. Oh my goodness, getting chased by bees. Build lasting friendship through common interests. Some nice, interesting ant farm. Spotting UFOs. Oh, no wake the llama from The Sims 2. Share common interests like making ceramics from a pottery wheel. Perfect your skills, playing the violin And get into the zone We can compete and show this is the best We can have dance competitions And also cooking competitions as well Turn talents into cash And watch your lifetime aspiration meter grow Fulfill a sim's aspirations and unlock special rewards. Get rewarded for during the post. Available Spring 2008. Well, that was a fun pack for the Sims 2. Sims 2 free time. There's a lot of stuff jam packed into one expansion pack. That is unfortunately in the Sims 4 era, they will just break it up into many many different packs, which is kind of unfortunate but we can have all that into one single pack and have a system that ties this all together our last expansion pack is the sims 2 apartment life move your sims out of the suburbs hmm. and into their own apartments oh that was an interesting gameplay with nice architecture Find the right apartment for your sims. You have the Murphy bed. I use Murphy beds as much. Well. <laughs> we have a tank for us. Your sims can live with roommates. <laughs> and return of the heart bed. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it took them 8 expansion packs to get back the hard bit. Oh, you can see, you can leave a look. Oh, the swinging around thing. That's the best interaction I have. Closet. Meet your neighbors and visit their apartment. Too soon. Too soon. Improve your sim's reputation to meet friends. Oh, There's different class and uh, sections, subsections of communities in the sim's apartment life. Oh. There's a mysterious bookcase that was really fun. So apartment life installs in summer 2008. So that was the last expansion pack for the sim's to apartment life. And they decided to go all out in apartment life. So yeah i really love this expansion pack as well i do build a lot of apartments you can check out in my channel okay that's pretty much all the trailers i want to see in terms of the sims 2 and the, their expansion packs what do you guys think please leave me a comment and don't forget to like share and subscribe to west anime sims for more updates on retro sims content thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video Bye bye